How's it going guys? So uh, we got some new animals and fish and stuff in today. So we'll start over here with some fish. Let's see what we got today. I did get a few more rose line sharks in. Um, we also got in some more giant danios. All right, so next thing we got in this awesome round tail blue marble. Did we get more rabbit snails? We did get more rabbit snails. Some nice big fat rabbit snails too, so they're pretty awesome. And then in that same tank, we also got a bunch more ember tetras and some hengali tetras, uh, rasabaras. And since I'm standing right here and it made me think about it, I just love this beta. So I'm gonna show it to you before it sells. It's got that like solid head color and then, I don't know, it's just awesome. I did get in some three spot where Paraguays, I can't talk today. Three spot Paraguay Tetras, um, which are really pretty cool. Pretty aggressive, so not recommended for most of your community tanks. Uh, to your right, I got in some Pearl Scaler Randas. Ah, I see. They look like a golf ball with fins and a mouth. <laughs> Don't they? Uh, poor fish. We did get in some awesome little cardinal tetras. Um, we've been out of them for a while. I hadn't been able to get them. I don't know if there's an importation issue, like any imports just not coming in or what, but we got them. I did get in another Polypterus Delhizi. And he's hanging out back there in the middle. Um, we did get in some more balloon mollies, so we got a really nice stock of those right now. Um, mainly orange, but they do have some really nice colors, so they're super cool. And then I saved the best for last. I know. We got in a hairy puffer. It's a puffer that's hairy. He came in really small, but still looks really awesome. He's very active and doing really well for just coming in this morning. Um, now these guys are cool, they don't get very big, so you can keep it in like a 40 gallon without any problems. Um, they max it up to 6 inches, but not common in captivity for that big. Usually you're looking under 5 in captivity, um, but you can't really put them with anything else. They will kill it. But <laughs> He looks like he wants to eat some of the other fish. Definitely a little bit better than like a Fajaco, where you have to have a full tank, um, a big tank dedicated to this one. So, so anyways, we'll go ahead and pass you over to Aspen. Okay, now it's time for the animals. We're gonna see who's new today. Who do we got here? First, we have this pied ball python. She's got so much white on her. She's she's not coming out of her shell, but that's okay, cutie. Oh, look at those spots. <laughs> Next, we have a burgundy Goliath bird eater. Not as big as our last one, but. Still impressive. Yeah. You get to watch it grow up. We do. Oh. Uh oh. Those ones have cool patterns, don't they? You can see their eyeballs. That that little one. Jenny told me that this one oh, you're so has pretty. a cool little pattern on the back and the, the one in, there's another one in there. Oh, there is another one. Yeah, in she there. says that, that one's got cool patterns too. We're all so pretty. Yes. Very pretty. Look at everyone! Oh, hello. Look at you. You're pretty too. I think the ones, the <laughs> more pale ones, are the ones that we just got in. Oh my goodness. What a party. Next, we have Turquoise Arata's Dark Frogs. We have some guys hiding. Oh, I see him. Get extra sneaky. Oh, oh, we do have a hider in the log. He's gonna come out too, Heather. Hi! Look at him. He's so cool. 
Hope those guys find a good home soon. Up next, we've got red-eyed tree frogs. We've got a few hanging about. They're sleeping. Yeah, Same as expected. Oh, there's one. He's laying right in there. We woke him up so you could see his eyeballs. They're so pretty. They're so pretty. Up next, we've got crocodile geckos. Uh-oh. We've got someone in the eye. Somebody's in, somebody's in the eyeball. I can barely see him hanging out in there. Let's see if I can... Oh, there's one. There's one hanging out right up there. They're being very secretive. I like these guys. And that was the animals. Thank you for watching.